I, I don't know. You know a lot of Democrats. Uh, how, if you're a Democrat, can you vote Democrat with all the bad stuff happening in the country? Well, two things, Bill. First, what you said about groceries is that inflation is a lot higher than the 8 to 10 percent we're being told. And people feel that. That's number one. And number two, what Democratic candidates are doing is not only not campaigning with Joe Biden, they're running away from the Democratic Party, the national leadership, and the ideology of the Inflation Reduction Act and big spending. So my party is literally in retreat. All right. So they are banking on abortion and other niche issues in their own states to win. That's what I'm getting here, right? They're not going to run on the national issues. They're trying to get a localized issue with abortion in the forefront. They are, but the polling that I think we discussed last time and certainly the case now, abortion is receiving as an issue as inflation and the cost of living are becoming more and more important, which is what's helping the Republicans and the Democrats, as you suggested, and correctly, Bill, are out of ideas. Okay, so the Democrats don't really have anything to run on. If you were consulting for a Democratic uh, Senate candidate, what would, you, what would you tell them? Run on what? I, I tell them you're standing against the National Party, you stand against their positions, and you're for the local uh, citizenry of whatever state it is against Washington. That's what right, I tell them. Look, Not a great not, argument? We're not seeing a lot of, uh, hey, let's seal up the border again from Democratic candidates anywhere. We're not seeing that. And that's a huge issue. We're not seeing that Joe Biden's incompetent on the economy. They never say that because they need the money coming out of the Democratic uh, campaigns. They need funding, right? All true. 